Tell me how you wound up in jail. That day, I was very, very frightened. It had just built into a situation where I was scared to walk out of my home thinking I was going to be shot and killed. So take me to this day. You show up at your husband's house. Well, the house was mine also. It had my name on it. I had been taking care of the kids and I was tired. I had not slept much. I did not have much money left and I wanted to leave town. So I left the children with my friend and Chris was supposed <clears throat> to be on his way to pick the kids up at my apartment. On my way out of town, I thought, you know what? I want to get my milk. And when I pulled into the um, neighborhood, he pulled in right behind me. The report says you showed up at his house wearing a bulletproof vest. Mm -hmm. I was going to the gun and knife show. I've been giving bulletproof vests to police officers through my charity for over 10 years. I have an honorable mention in Congress. So I had actually purchased one at the last gun show I had been at because I'm, I was interested in creating ballistics, bulletproof vests. That's my passion, that's what I enjoy. So I was dressed up. I had a very like, you know, cute outfit on. I decided to go ahead and grab my mail. And, you know, he wasn't supposed to be there. And we stood outside and had a conversation for a while. And you had a gun. Yes, my judge. A Taurus judge, mm -hmm. uh, an extendable baton. Mm -hmm, two of them I had. Uh, and a knife. I had several knives and I had a hatchet. I had a, a hatchet a taser. and a waistband. Mm -hmm. But so you have all of this with you. Yes, it was in my purse. I had a huge <clears throat> duffel bag purse. Okay, so. And all of it was in the purse. So you're, you're wearing this type heavy thing, a bulletproof vest. Yeah, it looked cute. It looked like Angelina Jolie. And then I had altered the vest that the man made because I wanted him to make vests for my company. So I had made some alterations to his vest to say, hey, can you create this for me? But you're saying that doesn't look good. Where uh, is the South? You know, you're from Texas. You know, we love our well, guns and we love our and home defense. This is a Taurus judge, right? Mm -hmm. And the, it's a great gun. So you, you had this with you at the time. I have a permit to carry concealed. I always have guns. i tell you what I don't understand is these things are heavy, right? Yeah. Put it on. I, I'd, I'd like Actually, to see this you. one is very light. This is really? nothing. Yeah, the one I had is much heavier. I, I just can't imagine. Yeah, this vest is. Seeing this someone. This one's okay. How much was this vest? Five hundred bucks. The one that I was wearing was only two hundred dollars, so it's affordable to every man, woman, child in America. You have to understand, with somebody walking through the door with that I on and this in but their I didn't, hand, I had this, this point, in my purse, uh, just, but here's the thing, that was in my purse, okay? This was on me, but then I had all this other black on, so really it blended in, you couldn't even really see it. Okay, well good. I'm enjoying this thing, this is nice.